weren't quiet about this shouting. They were raising their voice. They, they, they weren't quiet about it. They weren't discreet about it. They shouted, praise God to the highest heaven. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Praise God in the highest heaven. Praise God for he is the son of David. They praise God with passion. What is passion? Passion is conviction. Passion is emotion. How many of you know it's okay when you come to church to show a little emotion? Yes. It's okay to show a little passion. Now, last week, as I said, you let Beyonce, Rihanna, Bruno Mars, yes. come, come on. on now, yes. Mary Jane, yes. Taylor Swift, let, you let them come to the Coliseum, and I'll see a whole lot of emotion out of a lot of people. Yes. Again, we don't even show up late to these cars. We show up early, stand in line, and don't argue with us about the price. Hey, we show all kind of passion for these artists. Why can't we show God the same passion? The Bible says that the people, they praise God with passion. They shouted, lifted up their voice. And I believe Satan gets frustrated when we praise God with passion. When we praise God with conviction. Because passion is power. Pastor Graham, prove it to me. Well, the Bible says in the Old Testament, we referenced this last Sunday, that David, he praised God with passion. And the Bible says those who were depressed, those who were under the circumstances, the Bible says that the evil spirits left. Wow, passion is power. So passion is power. The Bible says the children of Israel, the Old Testament, you remember the story when they were around Jericho. The Bible says when they marched around the city on that last day seven times, they lifted up their voice, they shouted, they praised the Lord, and the walls of Jericho fell down because passion is power. And so that's why we have to praise God with emotion. 